Are you sure we're ready? That thing is still showing. Yeah, that's us. Okay. All right. Hit main and we're ready to go. I did. Oh. Oh. What is up? A welcome back. Do you like to do it, build it, or make it? So do we. And we have a new video each week. This week, we're prepping for the farmer's market. No. Craft show. Craft show. A big like craft show. a big show. craft show. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, we're going to do our porch leaner today. They're heavily requested at all of our craft shows. People want those porch leaners. And those that have seen us at the farmer's market have been asking about them. And we've been kind of we've been a little slack, slack on them. Yeah, yeah. On creating these porch leaners because... I don't like them. Well, you have to go outside, and we don't really do it at our paint yeah. table in I mean, there. So I like making them. I like designing them. Yeah, I don't like uh, Come transporting on. them. Who are you kidding? He doesn't paint any of the signs. He doesn't do any of the porch leaners. So I do. All, I am. I am the behind the scenes. Yes, you're I am the creating the designs. I'm and the, the designer. Videos. Yes. Yeah, and the cutter. Well, I guess Tanner's the cutter. Yeah, Tanner's the cutter. I'm the, uh, I'm you're the, the TikTok beta guy. Te test cutter. <laughs> yeah, I do all the, I'm the content creator. <laughs> all right, so on our Tuesday Live, you guys requested a strawberry door round. Um, so we took that and we made it into a porch leaner, but this coming Tuesday, we're going to have a strawberry door round to go with our porch leaner. Big so. Promises. Big yeah. promises. Yeah, it's it does not even been designed yet, so we <laughs> she, we'll, we'll pull out something. She makes my own promises. I start designing it in my head, and then I tell Garrett what I want, and then together we make it happen. <laughs> yeah, together. So we did this porch leaner. Um, we designed it. We have it all cut out, and so we're going to paint it today. Show you guys how we do our porch leaners, how quick and easy it is. Yeah, and then we'll have one to take to the farm to the craft show tomorrow yeah so it's super simple hold on let's get ready for step one okay <laughs> now tomorrow's craft show is going to be in aquaquan virginia so northern virginia so if any of you guys are up in northern virginia make a point to come by and see us we would love to see you it's a big marine base it's like huge well, it's not I me. Mean, the show's not on the base, though, right? We're right there on some sort of a river walk. We've not oh, been there it? before, Never so there. I'm kind of excited about it. Yeah, river walk. And they're going to cool. have bands and music. Yeah, craft show. We're down by the wine and the bands, right? Is that? Yeah, our, our booth, our booth is? is down there. Yes, by so. the music and the wine thing. What did you say? Like, but like five o'clock, we'll be giving away sides. I'll be like, I got to run down here real quick. I'll be right back. <laughs> <laughs> the later the day goes on, the steeper the discounts get. <laughs> yeah, yeah, come later in the day. <laughs> All right. Focus, All right. Garrett. Focus. All right, I'm focusing. Christina Hill says, good morning. Finally catching you guys live and staying for the whole duration. You oh, oh good. hi, good, Christina. Christina. We've missed you guys. We haven't seen you in a while. Yeah. Who else? Got Eric, some other fun friends. Scott Eric doing. On a Friday and I'm off today, so Scott will be here. Oh, oh it's well, like a holiday Scott. then. <laughs> yeah. uh, so did who? Oh no, that was Cheryl Shepherd said this is the first time I've ever been able to catch the live from start to finish. Oh, oh from start to awesome. finish. Well, hopefully awesome. we'll make it fast enough where you could catch it to the finish. Yes, we These we've got fast. some. Uh, we've got some. We this project is a little bit in progress because we knew we were doing it live, so. Yeah. We wanted to make sure we get a, through it like rather, relatively show. quickly. It's like, yeah. uh, we'll be it's up a little here, bit of like, baking show. Who's that? Who's that lady with the, oh, today we're making a turkey. Julia Child. Julia Child, yeah. It's like a little <laughs> Julia Child. <laughs> Step one, we're going to gather all of our supplies. We needed two dog-eared fence pickets. Six These foot. Six foot. We needed a... But wait. Now, these are the premium grade pickets. So yeah, they're smooth. See how smooth they are? Smooth. Well, relatively smooth. And I went um, yesterday and I tried to find all the straight and dry ones. Yeah, that's, that's your trick. So typically when we get them, they're pretty wet. And the wetter they are, the more likely they are to warp. So we you want to lay, lay them, them out. Yeah, you yeah. want to lay them flat Flip so that them. they... Make sure you 
You flip them. Turn them like in the oven as they dry out, and then you want to use them as dry as you can. You can yeah. do this with damp pickets, but, but hopefully warp. you've got some time. Yeah, as they dry, they'll warp though, so be careful. Then we have a three foot no. smaller Isn't picket. Isn't this like 40? Didn't we determine these were like 42 or something? I don't know. We're about to find out. I'm saying it's 36. I'm <gasps> saying it's, it's 42. 42. Kim's right. It's 42. Read it right on the bottom. That's for our cross brace. We need some glue, some brad nails. These are one inch. We need inch and a quarter. No, we don't. Inch and a quarter will go all the way through. Oh. We need like one inchers. And we have some glue for our kit. We have our kit, the cool little strawberry thing. I'm saying cool because I did it. Did you put and it in the store paints. already? Because we just I did. did. I was up late. <laughs> I was up late getting it ready. So if you want to follow along. It's You'll there. have to order it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, SVG's up there too. And uh, I'll put it up for the patrons like right after this. But uh, I What forgot. else? Is I that it? Last night. That is it. I think that is it. Uh, that's it. You yeah, said paint, that is right? it. Yeah. Paint, yeah. We got it all. Christina Hill says Eric is stuck in Telecon all morning, but he always watches the lives later. Oh. oh that's nice. Thanks. Comment. Let us know what he thinks. We missed you guys on the Zoom call. Wicked Crafter says, hello from Dayton, Ohio. That's closer to me. I, I might have to take a road trip. Dayton, Ohio. It's my roots. Yeah, I'll have to find a craft show up there. Garrett loves Ohio. If you've ever, those of you that follow us for a long time, we talk about it often. Garrett feels like in a former life or something, he has this connection with Ohio. I do. For some I reason. Yeah. <laughs> Never been to Ohio. I've driven through Ohio, but I don't think I've ever been anywhere in Ohio. You see but me getting out of the way. I love shh. It's too far. It's too tall. This is, I'll edit all this out. <laughs> <laughs> Step two. We're going to make all of our cuts. It's really just two cuts. We're going to cut this piece down to 11 inches, two of them. And we're going to use my pocket saw. We'll okay. pretend you guys didn't see me hide it. Just let you know to jump out of the way. Oh yeah. oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. She's a I veteran. do know. <laughs> She's a veteran. I right, do, do know. Do that and the dust. It is... <laughs> yeah. Every time. Dust is crazy. Mm -hmm. Let's just do a quick make sure. Uh, Tickled Toucan says, I did a craft show at a wine and beer brewery. It was fantastic. They were giving free samples all day. Same yes by the end of the day, putting the canopy back in its back. <laughs> yeah, like, you know, yeah, I, just I forget. Even, I don't need any of this stuff. <laughs> yeah, that would be me. I would be like, I don't even forget it. We'll just get That's it. it. We'll just get new stuff later. <laughs> I don't even care. I don't even care. Where's my Uber? Scott Hamill also says Porsche leaners are selling like crazy for him. Yeah, I know, Scott. Like, You're part of the cakes. reason. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You're Scott's part of the reason, the reason we were like, all right, let's bring these things. They're a higher priced item, and we know every time we bring them, they do sell out. So I don't know why we don't take the time to go out in the back and make them, but I did this week. I actually have three leaners that we already had like halfway prepared, and yeah. we'll make two more. It's because you just like to sit up there and paint and watch some TV. Well, they're a little harder to take to the <laughs> farmer's market, yeah, too. Yeah, transportation. That's what I was just saying. <laughs> Safety first, Kim. Candace is here. Oh, hey, hey Candace! Candace. <laughs> Hold your ears. Oh. Sorry, guys, if it's loud, this will only be a second. Two cuts. Two cuts. I lied. Make it a third cut because we're going to show them the back brace. Three cuts. Three cuts. Last one. Giving it a back brace. <laughs> had a had a back injury. It was a sports injury. Could have gone pro. Minnesota makes it. They need to start making four and Wicked Crafter said, "Come on up, Garrett. I just uh, I just got your summer notes, and I have a dribble. I need your skills." Oh. oh. You in Ohio, I'm ready to go. It's easy to do. It's easy to do. But try it because it's really cool looking. It does make a great technique. 
Scott says I need to get me one of those pocket saws. You do. Yeah, that you thing do. is great. That thing travels all around the shop. Yeah, you know what? We talked about to our top tier patrons, we need to do a giveaway because guess what we hit to in Patreon total? What? 100 patrons. That's awesome. Yeah, yeah. you can totally do a 100 Patreon giveaway. Yeah, totally. All right, we ready for what step is this? Three. Step, gather, cut, three. three. Step three. We're going to bring it all together with a little bit of glue and some braces and my one inch nails. And you didn't, what is step three? Step three is a uh, assemble. Yeah. Assemble. <laughs> step three, assemble. <laughs> We're gonna use those little cross braces and some glue and brad nails to uh, put it all together. So there's not a lot of measuring with this. We typically take a brace, we lay it at the bottom. That tells us yeah. where the bottom. I we don't use know. one of these as a spacer. Can they see? I don't know how yeah. well they can see over there. What's the side the cam? Side yeah, cam. let's see if we can do the side cam. Side cam me. Uh, I can see my mom's hand. Yeah, there you go. Move it up a little bit. There we go. How's that? Perfect. Can you see my hands? Yep. <laughs> All right. So I use, a <laughs> I use a spacer at the bottom. It's just to, I don't know, give it a space. What are you doing? Oh, squeezing them together. Yeah, you got to split the difference. Sometimes they're warped in the middle. Yeah, I just split the difference. Get it lined up. Use a little bit of glue. Now we've said a bunch of times, if you don't have uh, a brad nailer, you can use traditional Gorilla Glue. We're Gribble using glue. the wood Gorilla Glue. Um, because the great thing about wood Gorilla Glue nice is it dries clear. So if it oozes out from underneath your pieces or underneath your little brace here, it don't worry about much. it. It will dry clear. What's that? I think it went a little deep on the glue, but it's okay. Yeah, always. I don't. I don't know. I feel like. What happened to you I in kindergarten glue. that you felt like? <laughs> you had to yeah. Use so much glue. <laughs> some some obviously fell apart on me in kindergarten. Yeah. <laughs> Who didn't tell you to not over? Yeah. yeah, nobody needs more glue. Somebody must have said something in my developmental stages where I needed more glue. More's more. Mm -hmm. <laughs> now we're just gonna hit this with a one-inch brad. Oh, wait. The nail. Are you back with Not me? Not the guy. <laughs> Should I redo it? Everybody want to see it again? Probably not. I do a slight angle. Like, I don't know. I just feel like it holds a little better. It might be in my head like extra glue. Probably is. I just feel like if I pin it together, it won't come straight out. It'll have to work its way out. All right, work what are you trying it. to say down there, Court? You just got a lot of comments. Lisa Taylor says, Lisa from Peach Bottom here. My husband and I have been making the planter boxes you did a while back. We put our own spin on them, and they are crazy popular. Oh, well, yes, Lisa. we got to see your own spin then, Lisa. Yeah. Put you can't share, be just blasting that out. Share and, and the Kim and Garrett making group on it. Facebook so we can see it. And, and then I'll steal it. Well, we wanted to make a planter box. Actually, yeah. we almost did it today. Yes. This is almost I a I tried box. to get Garrett to do a planter and box. I said, I don't know about going live with a planter box. Yeah, I told him it wouldn't be so bad. I think I think we could have these also are, done that in the little stages. These are old hat. I mean, we do this all the time. Uh, Cheryl Shepard says, Kim and Garrett, there's a huge craft festival, the popcorn festival, every oh. year in Beaver Creek, Ohio. <laughs> Lots of attendees. You might want to check it out. I mean, he loves you're hitting popcorn. all my hitting all my buttons there. I mean, popcorn. You had me at popcorn. Yeah, you had me at popcorn in Ohio. Um, Creek is just outside of Dixon, she says. Scott says, "Congrats on hitting 100." Thank you, Scott. You helped make this possible. Uh, tickled toucan. I bought a pocket saw. It's heavier than I thought. I'm not finding it or flinging it around as easy as Garrett. <laughs> yeah, maybe I need to do it one time. Well, here's so what happens. You can see that I don't fling it, but it is easier to carry than it's, a large one. It's like dancing, right? You just start to know your partner, and uh, <laughs> the pocket saw knows where it's supposed to be. So, yeah, like any dance move, practice. 
<laughs> All right, one more for the back. So oh, we're doing the, That's right, we're doing the back. That's right. These are beautiful we're it right the back now. Brace. Look at how straight and beautiful these pickets are right now. But sometimes as they dry, these are slightly damp. Just very little bit, they're damp. But they may warp. Oops. So, wow. Yeah. I'm getting a mess over here. Well, my top kind of broke off. Uh, yeah, I saw you pull it off. Well, that's because it wasn't coming off. <laughs> and then I maybe gorilla styled the gorilla glue. All right, so our tip is, and what we do is we put this back brace on here, this one right in the center on Ish, the back, yeah. and it really does keep them from warping as bad. I really haven't had any problems when I put this little brace on. I don't measure for center. I just kind of Yeah, all guesstimate. you need to do is yeah. eyeball it. If anybody comes over here with, like, a tape measure, I'll just shoo them away. Go on, get! Get off my porch! Good, because it's pretty high on this one. Um, this I'm just going to make handle. I got a pocket saw and Brad too, but haven't used them yet. Would you give me an opportunity to use both? Yes. You got congrats a couple of times from both Patricia Roots and Tickled Toucan for hitting 100 patrons. Thank you. Yeah, we Candace, started. Or Candace shouted out, if all 50 of you wouldn't mind to smash that like button, that would be fantastic. Yes, remember, go ahead and hit that like button. If you're not yet subscribed, go ahead and do that too. And tick that bell to be notified of our new videos each week it's almost like that was rehearsed <laughs> you've done it a time or two all right our little porch leaner is ready to go that's, that's it, it. It's ready that was to go. it done and done now it's ready for stain or paint so wait, 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 wait. i'll let you i'll let you go steps. i'll let you go. Go, 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 go step four hold on i need a paintbrush Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. It's right there. There we go. Here's my stunt brush. All right, you guys. You get to see live how many times it takes to do this. <laughs> Step four. Ooh. Nah, that was sloppy. But he caught it. That was, yeah. that was good. First try. Step four. Now we paint. <laughs> Two times. <laughs> We're just going to use... Good. What paint are we using? Today, we're going to use we our paint special. in our jars because we're in a hurry. No, don't get me wrong. I love my country chic paint. Uh, but this is exterior house paint. And it'll. these are pressure treated uh, fence pickets. So they're great for outdoors. They're already set for and coated for outdoor use. And then I have exterior house paint, which I don't have to seal. Yes, Courtney, who is literally raising her hand behind the camera. Uh, don't forget to tell them that we do sell the Sherwin Williams oh. exterior house paint and paint kits for them. Oh, they, yeah. Them this does come in our paint kits now. Right. So if you guys are interested in purchasing a kit sometime and you want to paint it yourself but don't want to buy all the paints, we're now offering paint kits to go with each sign, uh, which is this exterior house paint. So, um that's something new for us is offering the paint kits to go along with it. Um, it was requested and I felt like it was a great ad uh, to go ahead and throw those in there. I'm also offering a bow so you don't have to go out and buy all the paints and all the ribbon just to make one sign. I can give you all the goodies to make your own Like sign. a straight up kit. Complete the whole thing. Oh, one stop shop. Yes, ma'am. We have another hand raised in the back. It oh. happens to be Courtney again. Oh, Courtney with all the questions. <laughs> um, we can also start including instructions with the paint kits. I've requested instructions yes. for them also. So. Tell me, you guys. How are you guys doing without instructions? So You're just winging it. That's why I was like, we just send them a jigsaw puzzle and say, hey, paint it and put it together. This one especially, I... I, so speaking of jigsaw puzzles, so Garrett did the design work on it. I kind of watched it, but I didn't see it cut. I didn't see him separate it. So all I was given was this kit last night to do a, like a pre-paint on it. And I was like, all right, let's see. <laughs> let's see what our users go through when they go through, when they get a kit and they have to figure it out. So I did have him print me a sign, print me a picture. And I did pretty good. Yeah, pretty um, good. One Not of them, bad. I was, I did have it yeah, wrong. Yeah, trouble with my W. I had it wrong, so I do think um, an instruction kit would be good with this one. <laughs> it's like your own. You're doing your own customer complaint. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Scott Hamill 
Nationals told Minnesota Makes, porch leaners are hot sellers. I made two for a donation and got six orders for different ones. Oh, oh wow. wow. That great. is great. Yeah. Well, that's so funny. Speaking of that, my sister called me last night. Ooh, I got to go do that. Call your sister before back. Before 9, 20, before 10 o'clock. I guess I can leave that You should do it here on the live. <laughs> yeah, call your sister. No, I need to send her a picture. Um, she is part of uh, some organization um, for... A women's league or something? Uh, yeah, a real estate women's organization. And they're doing a uh, silent auction. And she asked if I wanted to donate a sign. Of course I do. And advertise, you know, the fact that we make these signs. You can buy these signs unfinished. And then um, we offer workshops. And so... Um, she asked me to send it to her before 10, the, oh, picture, uh, the picture of a sign. <laughs> All right, I'm going to set this aside and let this side dry while we paint the little pieces. So that's how we're painting them. We use these little rollers. They work great. If you want to stain your pickets, um, we highly recommend, which I don't have any those in here. I think sponges. they're all in front. Those stain sponges. Like covered with terry cloth. It's a little sponge, yes, covered with a terry cloth. You just dip it in your stain, and man, it will pump through some. Yeah. Uh, so it, it will just give a great coat really fast. You can pump through some signs quickly with that. Uh, Minnesota makes. We'll, well clean up. So, yeah. Crafter asked what kind of Brad nailer Minnesota makes got. Minnesota makes said, I got the Ryobi one from Home Depot, bought it online. They have all Ryobi tools and share the, and they all share the same batteries. Yeah. They recently got the glue gun and the rotary tool. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes, um, and yes. Yep, they all share the same battery. I just used this one battery to do both pieces. It's great. All right, these uh, are all the little pieces. You use it for the saw and yeah. the nailer. Saw yeah, saw and the nailer. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is the one with all the strawberries on it. Yeah, I tried to separate them. Put all the strawberries on one sheet. All right, now this kit has a lot of pieces, but it's easy to paint because it has few colors. So we will show you. We're just going to pull this tape apart yeah. here, lay it out, and we'll slap some paint on these it's things three colors, pretty quickly. And, not, and you can pull apart all of the pieces so that none of the colors touch. And you can just paint all the red, all the green, all the black. Or get crazy with it. Get, just get... It's stupid creative with the strawberries, like make them look real. Uh, yeah, I bet you could um, Dremel oh, these guys. Oh yeah, I was just thinking that right when you went to say, get out of my head, Kim. <laughs> get out of my head. Dremel these guys, they'd be cute. Yeah, round off all the little strawberries. Ben Christian says, when you assemble unpainted, are you concerned the middle of the pickets might show unpainted? No. I, if uh, the middle of the pickets, Sometimes I'll get in there with a paintbrush where you can actually see it. But otherwise, I think the design will keep Just the eye away from it. Yeah. yeah, you're not really looking at that. Even when we stain them, I will still assemble and then stain. And you can't really see the insides. You don't see it. I'm having tape troubles over here. I am. Christina Hill said, we saw a little Ryobi pocket saw, but it was a sliding miter saw version. Oh. Yes, yeah, me, me too. I also saw the sliding miter saw version of pocket saw. That is on our next... Uh, I was afraid the bit if I brought that one home, pocket saw would get passive aggressive. <laughs> start hissing at him. Hissing. And he gets all puffed up. His tail gets all big. Just so you know, we have a new cat in the house and we're experiencing <laughs> this at home, which is why Garrett is using this as an example. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, real funny. life, real life examples. Definitely real life example. Uh, Oops. Almost lot says good morning from Fort Worth, Te Fort Worth, Texas. I'm so happy to finally catch y'all live. Love watching all your videos. Oh, good morning in Texas. How early is it there? I think they're only two hours two behind hours? us. Hmm. And uh, are you guys in the? path of that tropical storm or is that below you Might be oh below you is a tropical storm coming cross flag um i feel like i guess it's pretty far south i see it coming across cuba and then i feel like naming stuff tropical storm is misleading because you're like ooh, tropical hmm storm it just doesn't sound as threatening i mean it's like tropical cocktail 
I don't know. I can't think of anything else that's tropical that that's bad. All right, I'll show you this home. The bottom home actually has a strawberry vine going right through the O. So pay attention to that when you pop these out. I don't want to freak you out. It's supposed to be like that. The O comes in two pieces. It got it created. Didn't break. Got creative. I got with creative. It. I did. Well, I wanted to make it look like the vine was wrapping through, but try to keep it one layer so that the. I don't like doing layers on a porch sign or the leaners as much as I like doing them on the hangers. I don't know why. Tickled uh, Toucan Oops. says, Garrett is like a crack dealer showing all these tools. I've already purchased three because of him. I have more on my list. <laughs> Well, well I need where are you, Ryobi? Because yeah. they don't sponsor us. Ryobi. I told them we were going to have to kick Ryobi to the curb if they didn't hurry up and sponsor yeah. us. Ryobi not wants nothing to do with us. Right? You've tried so many times. This is a little fresh, said. No thanks. Yeah. Not my cup of tea. Candace also shouted out where to get our collection. Or oh. The, the strawberry signs. She showed the collection. Candace is great. All right, and I don't really get what Garrett's got going over here. I don't know if you can see. There's two sections of these things. Well, We've in the design. Hold on. Little... Where's the design here? Oh, man. I <laughs> <laughs> To your picture. Yeah. Oh, we, that didn't, was we didn't even flash that, so hopefully you guys saw the thumbnail. This is what we're working on right now. Hold on. Hold it up again. I just zoomed in. Yeah. Oh. Oh, yeah, you can see it now. Hopefully you saw it in the thumbnail, but if you didn't see it clearly, here's just a little quick sneak peek of sneak what we're peek. using to put this together. This is the kit we're putting together. So you wanted the red and bat, red and green yes. um, stripes on the thing, so I made a red and green stripes that you'd be able to just put on there. So this one's going to be green, and then... So we've got, like, extra stripes, though, it seems like. Well, I mean... I guess you can paint the picket piece red and then put them down. And you get extra stripes. Bonus. <laughs> Bonus stripes, yeah. <laughs> there you go. At no extra cost. <laughs> <laughs> Bonus stripes. What are you doing? You're getting a little crowdy over here. Yeah, I am getting crowdy. It's like a jigsaw puzzle. I'm trying to get Well, let's it all start with here. the smaller ones. Like, I can hold this one. I can hold this one as I do it. That's fine. That's cool. All right, I'm gonna put I'll my barely get paint on my hands. So, like these black pieces, you can whip these out really Most quickly. Do, 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 oh, you do, know what we don't have one. I don't have the black paint, and oh, I not, I'll two, go grab it. I don't have the paper plates so that I could pour the paint on. Oh, you sure don't. Be right back. Brb. Oh, oh, gotcha, gotcha with some paper plates. Mm. All right, there All you right go. I'll let you go grab. Um, are you going to use lime green? I think you want to use like this green green. Lucky green? Yeah, like this green. Yeah. I I like the lime green. But. Yeah, give your vote. So the strawberry has a green vine grow going through it. And Garrett thinks we should use this like lime green. And I think we should use like this lucky green here uh, and you see so. she puts the lime green down away from the project because i said i think we should so use I think the voting is in <laughs> well i gotta keep going but the next one i might do it with the lime green if you guys think the lime well, green here. will work Shh. why don't you do it with the lime green because we already did the other one with the lucky yeah. green do the lime green oh gosh okay i'll we'll have to put this paint away all right so i pre-painted one I will be able to show you what it looks like with the Lucky, and now I'll be able to show you what it looks like. Woo! Will I? With the lime green. Scott Hamill says, go back to step one and gather all your supplies, Kim. <laughs> right? I kept thinking, red, green, that's, that's all we need, and white. Nope, I was wrong. All right, now with this great little foam rollers, all you have to do is 
roll right over this. Now you can use makeup sponges. They work just as well. Just take a little longer. These foam rollers, if you're looking to make something for a craft show, um, then these little guys will save you some time. Back with the black. Got you guys on overhead again, just so you know. All right. That's a black piece. You want me to do the red over here? Yeah. I'm going to get this red Great. on. Get your red on. Get my red on. Usually I would go ahead and tape all of these down, but since we're kind of in a hurry here, I am just... Winging it. Well, yes, I mean, I'm winging it a little bit, so they're moving there. around a little. I still like to bring this to the farmer's market. Oh, no, we will. We'll rush. make sure. Oh. Oops. Uh-oh, Courtney's out. We gotta go find Tanner. Make him answer comments for us. Sarah could come in here and read comments. Right, Sarah? And bring a roller handle. Oh, you only have one? Yeah. I can go get one. See, you can see this is not our paint room. All right, so you can see how quickly you can paint these. This lime green is a light color, and typically on MDF, I would either paint it with a coat of white first, and then put the lime green, because it pops, the color pops just a little bit more, or um, I'll just do a second coat of this lime green, just to make it look a little more um, uniform, and the color to be a little more poppy, a little more vibrant. All right, we have a new comments person for us. <laughs> Sarah. Everyone say hello to Sarah. Hello. And Sarah let me know that, yeah, they couldn't hear um, Courtney. So Sarah's going to speak up louder. Oh, you guys couldn't hear Courtney. I said we would repeat what Courtney would say. Oh, I missed a piece. Here we go, here's your red. Yeah, I like yeah, that like we can anything, roll this whole thing. Anything that, uh, if they ask us any questions or comments that might be helpful for others. Yeah, only read the positive things, though. No. <laughs> Nothing about my arms. <laughs> yes, oh, could everyone Sarah. hear Sarah? No, you're whispering back there. You want to say hello back? Hello. I mean, we've well, already said hi. <laughs> Sarah says hi. Sarah with an H. Sarah with an H. They asked. Yes. Say, right. Sarah with an H. All right, so when we're done with our rollers, we'll put it in a Ziploc bag, and I just stick the whole roller lid in there and grab the top, and I can pull it right out of the bag. Usually it's not that hard. There we go. And then I save them and I use them again. I don't know, later today probably. Yeah, well, <laughs> right after the live where I got another one cutting, so. Yeah, we found out for our craft show we can't set up till 8 p.m. tonight. So yeah. our plan was to leave at like. Three? Yeah, probably mid-afternoon, early afternoon. Uh, but now... And it's like an hour away, so I think we may end up setting up tomorrow morning. Quick setup. But I mean, we're getting pretty good at setting up our booth. What's we know that? where things go. She said there's two mains, blue or green. Oh, the first one up top? Oh, they, they're both the same. They both go to the same place. All right, if you guys can see us again. <laughs> Sarah's getting a crash course on how oh, to work right. the cameras over there. Work the cameras over there. Yeah, so that's main. This All just right. splashes up our logo. And you can see here how quickly this is going to come together. I can paint this. The great thing about black is you can just go and go quickly because you don't have to worry about it oozing over the sides. With the green, I was 
being a little bit careful, trying not to get it over the sides very much. And we used new rollers, so they weren't full of paint. Once the ro rollers get full of paint, you have to be even a, a little bit more careful because they'll have more paint and they're more likely to ooze paint. Sarah's excited. She says you guys love her. <laughs> they love me. Because now I have friends. <laughs> Sarah's 17. We're not sure what's going to come out of Sarah's mouth, so Sarah doesn't need wow. to be mic'd. Sarah gets canceled. <laughs> yeah, we don't need Sarah getting us canceled. All right. And you can see how much paint that took, just very little, one little squirt. All right, so your pieces are pretty much painted and ready to go, right? Uh, yeah, I'm done. You done? Yeah, I'm just about done. Now, like I said, we already have some painted that are dry. We don't want to wait for these guys to dry. I could get the hair dryer out and dry them really fast. Yeah. I know you can't see me, but I just have to get on this side of the... Oh, I wasn't saying anything good anyway. I was just insulting Sarah. <laughs> You're welcome. All right, look at there. So quick, right? Done and done. And what I was saying is we could get the hair dryer out, dry these very quickly, put another coat of this lime green on and be ready to go. But because we're on a live and we're 9.38, we're 38 minutes into this, we're gonna set these aside and bring out the ones we already have painted. So do your Julia Child. Oh, I never really watched the show, but I'll go ahead and say, we'll what? set these aside. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. We'll just set these aside and visit them later. On your Glowforge with nothing? Yeah. All right, I'll set some of this back here. We'll just edit all this out. Yeah, edit all this out. You don't want to bore everybody watching. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right. Done painting. Look at that. Oh, is that dry? You're good. It's just the back of it anyway. It's not going to... Yeah. I was spreading it out. Help it dry Try faster. enough to lay that on there. All, All right. right. Here is our pickets we already assembled, painted. this. We painted this last night, although the other one's probably pretty dry. I'd put a second coat on that one too, although right now it looks like it's got like a whitewash look on it. What was it, step five? Step one, two, three. You're still in step three, assemble? No, the step four was paint. And the step five is? Assemble again. Assemble again. <laughs> step five. Assemble uh, again. We're just going to glue down all of our little pieces that we just painted. All right, and you might want to um, go overhead with this one, Sarah, so that uh, they can kind of see. These are going from bottom up. Yeah, we'll go bottom up. Where's my picture? Can I ask, do you sell your kits at craft shows or just the first product? Well, do we do we sell our kits at craft shows or just the finished product? It's just the finished product. A couple of the craft shows say no kits, Not no allowed kits allowed. Bring, uh, unfinished items. No. Dogs so we just allowed. don't even bother anymore. Yeah. Don't even ask. 
Or are you getting sick of getting yelled at? Get sick. Stop yelling at me. Hmm. Where does this go? Yep. Then this one See? goes here. Yeah, it's not too bad. You made it sound worse than it really is. It's pretty self-explanatory. Is it? Maybe. This I know goes on this side. This goes on this side. Well, the good thing is I made all of the strawberries the exact same size so you don't have to yes. figure out which strawberry goes where. That is a nice treat. Sometimes these things, when he does different circles, like the watermelon seeds, they're not all the same size. So. Well, I tried, but then when I squished it, it changed all the watermelon seeds slightly. Here's a W, and here's a W. This goes over here somewhere. I don't know why I put all the strawberries up here. This goes down here. Somewhere. Look. Now that we're, <laughs> now that we're in, uh, so this no, goes down here. watch your sign. You can pay attention. If you look at this very closely, you can see it. All right. So you've got that one. Yeah. Now you need this one. Yep. It's mm -hmm. going to go right there. Yeah. Yeah. Cross. Now here's your loop. Your loop goes inside this E. Yeah, give you me your loop-de-doop. And then these little strawberries right here. W goes in here. These little strawberries tuck in here. Oh, yeah, that's right. They tuck in there. And then this one goes up here. Yep, I think that was inside the W. The last break. S fits right in there. And bring that all the way down. Yeah, there you go. And the S fits in there. This is the top of the W. And then this little piece goes right up here. All right, no, I don't know. Or does it? it? Yeah, does it does. Good? I have comes to have room for home. Yeah, it comes out. Oh, it goes out. over there. It goes down in here. Yeah. Maybe not quite that far. Let me put home on here. All right, you guys still with us, Sarah? You guys yes, speak up. What's happening over there? We got a little focus on what we're doing. Yeah. <laughs> Getting into the layout. Doing a jigsaw puzzle. I love that you reuse anything that you can. I'm also very concerned with my supplies. Oh, yeah. We'll be dumping that lucky green back in the bottle. Uh, for sure. For sure, stuff isn't cheap these days. It sure is not. All right, I'll get my strawberries in there a minute. Hold on, I got a double here. Oh, that's a double. I got a single. Single. Is that it? Oh, I got a double left. That's a double. Oh, a double. No wonder it wasn't fitting. I was like, I can't figure out how to get this in here. It's a double. No, we're missing the single. Oh, here's the single. Yeah, just like that. All right, so cute. Look at that. Can you guys see it? Go overhead, Sarah. Yeah. And All right. Put this down here. Yeah. You go on all right. opposite. I'll get this out the way. Terry all right. Just catching the end looks fabulous. You don't need to Looking do great. Let's glue it down. All right. So we are going to use both. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Some of our Starbond glue and uh, wood glue. Starbond will hold it. 
but it doesn't have quite as strong a bond as the wood glue. So we're going to do a little of both. We're going to put the star bond on there to hold it so that we can hold it up and show you guys. And then uh, the wood glue to hold it a little more permanently. Great idea. Here's your, uh, our little glue brushes over here on the floor. I saw it. I think that's going to be too big. All right, you want to go heavy with the... They go heavy with the star bomb. All right. Teamwork. I can't That's get it. close to it. <laughs> All right. Well, maybe we won't be able to hold it up. Maybe you'll just have to do side cam. We'll just do like star bond at the top and bottom on this one. All right. Scott says Candace is all over the links to get supplies. She is. Yes, yeah, she is. <laughs> Candace is awesome. <laughs> Candace is all over the links to get supplies. That's what. There's a blue link. There's a kit link. There's a Patreon link. Nice. We got links for days. Links on links on links. All right. How are you Candace doing it all says, at once? I gotta help support K and G every way I can. Yes. Thanks, Candace. It's because Candace is awesome. Everybody knows this. You need the bottle. You need to do some like glue dabbing. Dabbing. Yeah, dabbing this paintbrush is a kind of a slow technique. Well, you're a little fast with, a little fast and loose with the star bond. I don't know who you think you are, Maverick. <laughs> Top Gun references. Topical. Which we haven't seen. Has everyone seen it? Totally want to go. There's misconcepts about how military people enjoy the movie Top Gun. Well, I guess my uh, mind might be a little bit different. No one can hear you. Either speak up, speak confidently. Or stop cheating, chat. I'm trying to paint. I'm trying to paint the glue on. Get some more glue. That's empty. Whoa! This you barking orders. Uh, well, I just wow. want to make sure we don't lose wow. everybody because who wants to watch glue dry? All right, that's what I was trying to tell a story. Telling stories. Story. Who wants to hear a story? <laughs> who wants to hear a young Garrett story? It's not an exciting story. It's just. How many times I saw the movie Top Gun when I was on an aircraft carrier. It was literally on like every day. Every day. Multiple times a day. It was like on a loop, I swear to God. It's very inspirational. Yeah. It made me hate watching television. All right, where did this one go? Now down, I lost it. Down, right yeah, down. bring it on down. Bring it on down to Strawberry oh, Town. No. Um, you want to go sh show Scott your military signs? Did you post oh, any yeah, of those you want me yet? Go get them? Nope, sure haven't. I haven't even taken any pictures. So we did get a few painted, uh, mostly Marine ones because Marine Corps, because that's the base we're going to, a Marine Corps base. So we're focused on those this week. But a couple of Army ones, and they look awesome. So, but you've already done that logo, so. Yeah, just paint it with the gold. I made a cooler one, but it takes too long to cut. So we opted out of it. Hold on, let me go get the other one. Yeah, I was gonna say, you got a few of them. Yeah. A couple of veterans, active and veteran. Any updates over there? A lot, yeah. Um, well, you can go ahead and jump in any time. Okay. Minnesota makes, we're going to see Maverick tomorrow night. I've seen it, it was great. Uh, 
Sandra says, my husband is getting ready and keeps stopping to watch you guys. <laughs> Almost 7 a.m. here. And Fresno. Oh, in Fresno. Yeah. It would be three hours behind. Nancy Ware says, I love Top Gun. The new movie was awesome, too. My hubby is retired Navy chief. Oh, then yeah. See? I'm excited about it. I'm thinking we might end up going tomorrow night um, after the craft show. We're going to stay the night in uh, up at Aquaquan. So might be something we could do with the kids. Go a little movie night. It's hard Try doing both. All caps. Oh my, I need those files for sure. wasn't all the way oh those little stars that's because I just dropped those in there last night <laughs> yeah because I don't think they were planning to include them well because I don't think Courtney helped me put those together and I think she wasn't going to put the stars in but I felt like um, they added a little something so I kept them Awesome. We look forward to it. Yeah, it's not one that you can pump out weekly. It's it's one of those special order kind of signs. Oh, I pulled a Garrett. Too much glue. All right, guys, we're getting through this. I saw your new door hangers with the gnome and the sunflower. So very cute. Will they be available on Patreon? Oh, did I not put the sunflowers up there? I totally meant to put the sunflowers. Absolutely, they'll be available. They should already be there. Wicked Crafter says, great sign, at Garrett. Oh, thanks, Wicked Crafter. <laughs> <laughs> yes, the signs will totally be available up on Patreon. I totally forgot to put the sunflower. And there was another one I'm missing. The mushroom. I think it was the mushroom. I'll put them both up there. I forgot. Gotta keep me honest. Yeah, sometimes he's so busy doing for Ooh, one. Getting crazy with the glue over I there. I am getting super crazy with the glue. And why is that? Well, because it doesn't have its top on it. Just like you said. Yeah. Don't get frantic. I'm losing control. Together, girl. I think I got That's that glued, one. Yeah. I think this line might have to stay here because I'm. You're getting crazy with it. Yeah, getting a little crazy. That's okay. That'll dry. Not that big, gloppy clump. It might dry tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, I got a little bit of a some glue globs going on. That's not down. Well, what are you doing? What's happening here? You're getting a little crazy. You need a nap? I think somebody needs a nap. <laughs> Hold on. Let's fix one problem before we move on to the next problem. I'm having a hard time keeping up with you. With my drama? Yeah. I can't fix it. As quickly as you're breaking. Hold up. Are <laughs> <laughs> we just switching glues every now and then? That's What's what happening? I said. I'm switching glues. Getting crazy. Just flip-flopping glues like it ain't no thing. You don't got to rush. They want to see something awesome. They'll wait. 
to wait for the awesomeness. It's going to be groundbreaking right here. Oh, we're going back to the wood glue now? What's happening? We in, we out, we're out, we're in. Up is down, left is right. I got a mess over here. Where's my little uh, foam thing? What? You got a mess? Here we go. My little sponges. Do some cleanup. You can take it from here, Garrett. All right, I got you. We all know who the glue king is. Tanner. Nope. How many glue mishaps have I had outside of today, just now, when I messed up the army sign? But and then. Says, Don't worry, we'll wait for the awesomeness. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. I am. Uh, I am stressed and trying to get it done so that I'm not wasting your time. So you're not watching glue dry. Almost there, almost there. 9.57, we're still under an hour. Yeah, it's good. Good things come to those who wait. <laughs> what are you giggling about, Sarah? I'm giggling about Candace and your comments. I want to remind you all to smash that like button, tick that subscribe to get all the notifications and share this video. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, I'm dripping on my hand. Candace is awesome like that. She is always... Yeah. Yeah. If you're watching, give me that like button. It helps us out. It does. It helps us pop up in front of other people that might enjoy this video also. There you go. I'll hold it for you. It was a long one. Thanks. It is a long one. A little gentle. A little bloop blop. A little bloop. Bloopity bleep. Blop and bloops are here. Who's the glue king now? Huh? Mm. Mm. Over the hand. Around the tail. Out the door. Look at that. Straight down the middle. You're going to need a little something else on these strawberries. Oh, yeah. I just didn't want to get crazy over your hand and it seep through the strawberry seed holes and. Next thing we know, your hand is glued to a strawberry. All right, we ready? All right. I'm in. That's it. Yeah. We're down. We are Perfect. down. No going back. Look at there. This thing fits perfectly in here. I think it's down here. Right. Yep. Yeah. Awesome. Are we mixing mediums here? Are we mixing uh, securing methods? I'm going to use both. Candace says, I try to say it like Garrett. I'm glad you got it, Sarah. <laughs> <laughs> Sarah's a mini me. Sarah's a mini Garrett. So much so. And they look so, he's, she's just the female version of Garrett. So much so that when there are pictures on Facebook and it says, is this, and it'll show, uh, it'll be Sarah if she's got, I don't know, just in certain. She was wearing a hat and it said, is this Garrett? Is this Garrett? <laughs> and more than once has it said, is this Garrett? And I'm like, no, this is Sarah. <laughs> so funny. Oh, oh, yeah, who my posted goodness. my intro? Somebody posted their daughter doing Scott, my intro. it was Scott. Was it Scott? Yes, yes. Yeah, I had to do a double take. I thought it was me. <laughs> she did such a great job. It was so cute. She was cute smiling. It was so adorable. She was doing arms and all. All right, I think Is the we... top done? Yeah, I did that right. early on. You want to gamble on lifting it? Oh, you know what? Let's, Let's do our little top and presses. bottom stripes here. Let's do some pressing. We'll get yeah. there. But we're, it's gonna, okay. we're gonna lift it, but no guarantees it's gonna stay for right now. Uh, top and bottom straight. Yeah. Lisa Shepard mentions how you how Yeah. How what? I love how y'all work together. I like twins. We work together like twins would. Yeah, we work together I mean most of the time things are good. 
You gotta learn. Like I, I can see when I'm about to aggravate him to death. Yeah. <laughs> but I can't. I don't know when I. I just push it. I keep going. I usually start with the. Can you What's guys? Wrong? Do you guys? Is that surprising, you guys? The like Garrett pushes it. <laughs> it is shocking. Yeah, go over there. On, on here. This thing. What, well, Garrett's got his mic up higher than mine? So yeah. yeah. <laughs> I think I'm this one. Okay. Okay. Is it that my mic is too high, it's or is it I'm too, too much? Is this where this one goes? Um, okay. yes. And then this is going to go right below it. So this time, instead of adding, you can always add a ribbon and a bow. We do that a lot. But for this one, I thought I would try something a little different. And the cross braces would get their own little piece, little accent piece. Uh, Candace says, tell Kim to re uh, remember to text her sister. Scott says, Kim, oh. text oh. your sister. Yeah, text oh, your God. sister. Vicky says, Kim, text your sister. <laughs> I got to go Wow, you guys her. are awesome about the reminders <laughs> for texting it. your sister. I love it. I love it. It's ten o'clock. Yeah, that's why they're telling me. Sister should be watching right now. So. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna end this, and I'm gonna go do that right now. Hold on, I'm missing it. Oh. Right here. Good job. Good job. There's no accents to add. So yeah, so that's what I was saying. And so you could always put a bow, a cute well, strawberry bow. Anyway. I think that would be adorable. Step five. Now we have the accents. We don't have any. So. <laughs> So I was just the trying accent, to buy time. It would be these top and bottom pieces here. Yeah, we added to the cross brace. We've Did. not done that before, and I think it looks, it gives it that finished look without having to add a ribbon to it. Everything's getting oppressive. Which is great because sometimes when we do two side signs, you have to add the ribbon just like on one half of it. Come on! Garrett's giving it life support. Come on, get back here! <laughs> Stay away from the light! <laughs> Oh, the wood glue, because like yesterday, Kim made a bunch of these signs, just the regular home signs, left them and came back a couple of minutes later, and one of the E's kind of uh. slid off to the side. Got a lazy eye. <laughs> so you want to use the wood glue because because it dries quickly. And it's you can strong. use a little dab of this um, star bond to kind of keep it in place right away so it doesn't slide. And then you want to let your home sign sit and then let that glue dry. But for our porch signs, the door rounds, we just use a star bond. That works great. It well, holds up to the yeah. weather. So the uh, the star bond is great for flat on flat. But when it's grainy, these grainy tickets. like this, I mean, this isn't super grainy, but it's not flat. That star bond doesn't have a whole lot of grabbing power. I pulled it out so you could hold your sign up. Oh, is that what you're doing? Yeah, yeah. All right, I guess we're going in for the lift. All right, let's see. I hope everything stays on. I hope we don't get a lazy <laughs> E. Uh, bam. I don't know how much. Whoa. I just oh. slid a strawberry. Oh. We're sliding all over the place. We'll lay it back down. We'll lay it back yeah. down here. All right, here's a quick one. We'll give you guys a side view. Here we go, overhead cam. I'll run it by <laughs> real slow like a train. This is how he does his final shots. <laughs> yeah, it's all manual. Yeah, the bottom slid. Okay, we'll stop lifting it. Sorry, guy. Sorry. All right, there you go. We chit-chatted and put together a home sign in less than an hour. Without the chit-chat, you could have added that second coat of paint on the other pickets over there and be ready to go. I still think you can put one together in less than an hour. Oh, yeah. You can put I multiples did yesterday. together. If you set everything out, you can do three That's or four of them in, in an hour. Just crank on through. Crank through them strawberries. Just... Jam it out. But when you're done, your arms might feel like jelly. 
So preserve your energy and do them in steps. I can't think of any more strawberry jokes. So big thanks to all of our patrons. I'm going to add them here later on. But you guys know who you are. Like Scott. Christina and Erica. Christina and Erica. Who else is out there? Yeah, you guys are all out, out there? there. Yeah. I can't hear you being all. Now we're going to hook her up. All right, so we're about out of time. So if you're not going to join us for the patron after show, we will see you next week where we'll do it, build it, and make it again. And catch us on Tuesday where we do something live. Usually it's like a test file. It's been test cut Tuesdays for the last couple of weeks. So it's going to remain that way for a yeah, while. I got another test cut coming. Yeah, we know oh, we're doing strawberry. Tuesday's this test Tuesday. cut is going to be a test cut of the strawberry round. Come back keep, and join us. Keep the strawberry themed. It's sweet like that. All right. We'll see you guys next week. Now i got to sit here and just smile at you. Yeah, for 30 seconds. Sarah doesn't know how to end it, so now Garrett's got to go end it. <laughs>